I finally came to Bangkok. The, the six months I was here, I fell in love with Bangkok and I didn't want to leave. I didn't choose Bangkok. We opened here, it was destiny. When I started Gagan, I was part of evolution of this city. Every night, if I am in Bangkok, and if I am in my restaurant, I am here cooking. A lot of people ask us what kind of food we serve here. To me, it's a good reflection of Bangkok, of Thailand. We serve only 100% local produce, indigenous produce that exists only within Thailand. We use techniques from all over the world to reflect the best taste possible. I think it's local produce with eclectic flavors. I'm very lucky to be part of the city's change. Everything around me has changed a lot. All these changes bring me to a new life. And this new life, when I carry it forward, I carry my inspirations, my life. If I eat something and I love it, I will make sure it is in the menu. And everything became a fantasy. And fantasy became dream, dream became true. A luxurious day in Bangkok would be to start off uh, having brunch in one of the many five-star hotels, maybe by the riverside. Get a nice massage because you are in Bangkok and it doesn't get any better than this. And end your day at a rooftop bar overlooking the city, have a few drinks and a nice dinner in another restaurant. I think that's the best and the most luxurious day you could have in Bangkok. Bangkok is a city which is never sleep. Foodies come here to expect a lot. They expect to be wowed. For people from West, or from big cities, what is luxury for them is daily for us. The taste of Bangkok is in fish sauce. Fish sauce is the golden ticket to cooking Thai food or enjoying Thai food. The taste of Bangkok is uh, a chili. This is the street food capital. I think the thing I love most about Bangkok is its people. It's it is the people that make this city. I don't think I have seen such energy, such vibrant set of people anywhere else in the world. That is Bangkok.